Hi guys, it's me Natalie here and today I am going to show you how to do some cheerleading jumps. Sorry, I'm just doing some slippers. And I don't usually like do it right here, but I kind of thought because, you know, I'm not really going to be doing a lot. So, yeah. So, I am going to show you, I think, three or four. The herky. It's when you go like this and your legs bent. Um, a toe touch, which is your legs are both out. I forgot what this one was called, but you go, you put both feet out in front of you and reach down. You, um, then, yeah, that's it. I forgot that. A pike, that's what it is. Mm, so yeah, um, let's get started on the herky, then we'll do the toe touch. And then I will do the straddle. Oh, wait, straddle? Why do I keep on and say that? I've been saying that like all day for some reason. So yeah, let's get started. So what you will want to be able to do is this. Sorry. You're going to want to sit and kind of a... It's going to be just like this. And so, yeah, I know you can't see my face, at least all of it, but I am still here. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> and so, you're going to want to make sure you point your toe, like, a lot. I, it's hard to show it on camera. Yeah. Like, point it. I know it looks like I can, but I can't. <laughs> yes, these are my tennis shoes. Okay, so yeah, you're gonna want to sit like this and kind of like reach down just to get the feeling. Have one hip like this, and so yeah. So I'll show you the actual actual jump, and then I'll show you what why you you need to know that. Well, you know you will, but so this is how how I hold them. I hold my hands like this and then I cross them really get that plie and jump into it but some people go like this they go and then they jump so I'll show you both ways and both like type of ways with the jump um, all three jumps so yeah this is why I'll start with this one um so you will want, and when you're on your, um, the herky, you, you want this hip to be, or your hand on your hip, instead of going, it's, it just looks like, more like a, um, pike, or whatever, or straddle jump, no, a pike, I was right, okay, and so yeah, sorry, <laughs> so you're gonna, I'll do it this way, wait, no, yeah, I'll do it this way first, so you go, this, this, jump. It doesn't really work for me because I know you go like this and then go down to your play, but I always forget that part. So I'll try that again in the plie. At least I'll try to remember. So it goes kind of like that anyways, but I'm better at doing it the other way. So I'll show you that way right now. So, and you really want this leg to be straight and this leg to really be bent. I know I put my leg like this. I've been practicing to get it out. So, like it's kind of out, it's like right here. So yeah. Um, You will want, or this will be the toe touch done on each side. So it goes this, or, Oh crap, I don't know what that was, sorry. Okay, so. Like that. I, I jumped kind of forward, that's why I jumped kind of far back. And so, this one, I keep on forgetting the name, sorry. But it's um, a pike, I believe. Yeah. Straddle jump, maybe? It's either a pike or straddle jump, I can't remember at all. I'm pretty sure it's not a straddle jump. Like, this is my first year doing a butt chair, so yeah. I'm in fifth grade. Sorry. 
an idea. So, I have a really nice teacher, but sometimes she doesn't really, like, well, she does, actually. She's a really nice teacher. So, it goes like this. I could see it in the camera. My hand was, oh, or this leg was up more than this leg. This leg was, like, right here. This leg was, like, eh, like here. No, maybe not that far, but, but yeah, so, like this. Like that. You want to really be able to like touch your toes. And before you do all this, you want to stretch. So you go like, you want to cut. I know this isn't like part of it, but you kind of want to still roll out your hands and stuff and roll them. So you like, um, like can reach. And you really, really need to do the stretch. You might pull a muscle. You need to reach for your toes for about a minute, maybe 20 seconds, half minute, yeah. And, and then um, flex them. I know I'm wearing two different socks. And yes, I am wearing green on St. Patrick's Day, obviously. This is green, it looks like yellow. So is this, the writing it says Adidas. Then there's green, like gray at the tip. Then there's blue at the tip, that's what I wear. I'm not wearing green at all, except for that and there's some right here. Uh, you probably can't see it, but I'm not gonna lift my shirt up anymore. Jeez. And so yeah, so you really need to stretch like that. Oh, and another way, you need to stretch like this and really reach out in front of you for about another half an hour. Or <laughs> why do I keep on wanting to say half an hour? Don't know. I'm weird. But half a second. What am I saying? Half a minute. Okay, there. Whew. So yeah, um, some gymnasts do, or uh, cheerleaders, they go like this. They go this, 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 or they go like that, and it is tiring. So yeah, I really hope that video helped. If not, just <laughs> just keep practicing. And yeah, holy crap, that is tiring. That is tiring. Whew. And make sure you really um drink water. <sighs> I gotta get some. Um. So yeah, you need to get water, and you need to. Sorry, I can really talk. So yeah, um, you really need to do that. And if you have watched the Shay Tides, you need to tell me how good you think of think of them. Whew. <sighs> Sorry. I know they have weird nicknames, but I think it's kind of cute. Rock Tard and Bro Tard, so cute, the little baby. And so yeah, um, uh. You also need need to watch Cheernastics too. They're they're really good at this. I'm not good at all. This is like my third fourth video. And so yeah, um just give me some more ideas too on what to do. Don't forget to click subscribe down below. Um thumbs it up and leave a comment down below so make sure you um watch the shaytards and um i hope you enjoyed this video and so yeah bye